Good afternoon. My name is Sue Walker, and sitting next to me here, the gentleman in the nice hat, is my spouse, Reverend White Otter. And we're happy to be here. What have they told us? Well, first of all, at least some of the Big Brother nations are not primitive people just learning to make fire. Our Zeta friends tell us that the Sasquatch history on this planet alone goes back 20 million years to the beginning of the Neogene period. The Ponte tells us you can find Sasquatch people on many worlds because theirs is a body type that adapts very, very easily and very readily. They're very, very durable people. So, if some of this Sasquatch really are friends with E.T., or even E.T.'s themselves, why create all these primitive structures? Why would they choose to live here on Earth in such a low-tech manner if they have friends in such high-tech places? Right? According to our Zeta friends, you do not have to be high-tech to achieve what they call advanced civilization level zero. They tell us that a number of the Sasquatch nations are actually at a higher advanced civilization level than we are. That's because they provide for their people. They make sure that everybody has food, and water, and shelter, and is taken care of. Because in 20 million years time, what they figured out is a way of living that keeps everything in balance, physically, emotionally, and spiritually. And makes them happy. Just makes them happy. They're happy the way they're living. Isn't that your goal? They live life in the now. And they find themselves and their people better off keeping it simple without the technology. We Earth humans, no, we have not reached advanced civilization level zero yet. We don't provide food, water, and shelter for all our people. We just aren't there yet, folks. And we don't live in balance with our world. Not by any stretch of the imagination. Not even a little. Patterson-Gimlin film is considered to be the most believable Bigfoot video of all time. The 16mm footage was captured all the way back in 1967 near Bluff Creek in Northern California. Roger Patterson caught the footage while filming a horse ride with his friend Robert Gimlin. After spotting the creature, Patterson jumped from his horse to continue filming, which left the film somewhat of a shaky mess. However. Through the years, Bigfoot researchers and analysts like M.K. Davis have used various video techniques to stabilize and enhance the film. But going back to the time of the original 1967 filming, the Sasquatch footage was screened for special effects experts at both Walt Disney and Universal Studios. The panels agreed that the footage would be almost impossible for even a professional studio to fake, given the special effects techniques and equipment available at the time. Over 50 years later, the Patterson Bigfoot footage remains a heavily debated mystery. No one has ever been able to prove the footage fake or reproduce a similar film. It remains the most believable Bigfoot footage of all time. Is Sasquatch telepathic? Yeah. 
We know that at least some of the Big Brother nations are. I can't vouch for all of them. I haven't been to Asia or Down Under or New Zealand or any place but North America. Check. But here, we definitely have some telepathic nations. Usually, they check to see what your intent is the minute you enter into their territory. They know what you're going to do before you do often. Can they wipe your memory? Yes. All telepathic nations, including the Sasquatch, can and would if they needed to. They have homes and families to protect, guys. Hi, I'm a mom. One of the hardest jobs out there. This is Junior. If you could, you would make sure that anybody who approached your kids was safe too, wouldn't you? You also might find you have some missing time. With the missing time or the quote, memory wipes, your memories aren't gone, guys. They will surface themselves frequently. This morning, Otter had a memory of Big Brother Sasquatch down by a creek in 1960. He was 10 and he remembers going fishing with his father, rounding a bush, and there's Sasquatch, stands up with two trout in his hands and walks up the bank holding the trout. That memory didn't surface until he woke up this morning. By the age of five or so, when Big, Bro Big Brother's kids are taught when, where, why, that it's important to stay unseen to the Earth humans. Every once in a while they slip up. They're kids. They get surprised, they get startled, or they just don't stop and think. Or they're kids, they just forget. After I left the conference here last year, our local Sasquatch clan leader came to me and asked me specifically, would you please draw us as we see each other, not as monsters. I don't care which nation you pick, we'll send anybody to you that you want to pose for you, but just portray us as we really are. Thank you very, very much. Appreciate it, have a wonderful day. Hey! Hey! They do have a good humor. Sasquatch is just messing with you.